Hello everyone, I'm Brian. Today I'm going to be doing a reaction to The Last Duel, trailer number one, 2021. So, I think that's the picture. The Last Duel. Um, I was thinking like, you know, um, the, the little muskets where they pick a gun, turn around, take take 10 spaces, turn around and shoot. But I think this is more of a medieval thing. I end up hovering over the trailer and it showed them doing the jousting. I very much like the medieval era, but anyways, I don't know anything about this, let's go ahead and give this trailer a shot. There is only one question that matters. Who won? Do you swear on your life that what you say is true? My father told me my life would be blessed with good fortune. I'm married. I was a good wife. Hmm. And then was judged and shamed by my country. Helen of Troy? I say before all of you. Well, not really, I but... spoke the truth. Oh, true story. The most unspeakable charge has been brought against you. Jacques Legree entered our home. He attacked me. The accusation is false. I am telling the truth. The truth does not matter. There is only the power of men. This should be settled quietly. I am innocent! I request a duel to the death. If you lose, your wife will suffer dire consequences. One of us has lied. Let us let God decide. You do not believe me. I am risking my life for you. You are risking my life so you can save your bride. For bearing false witness is that you are to be burned alive. I will not be silent. I don't know, based on a true story, whose story is this? I don't. I, I'm not familiar. <laughs> Anyways, um, we are Helen of Troy. You know, she ran away to. I forget who it was, um, oh yeah, Troy, <laughs> and I guess she ran from Sparta, can't remember the names, some terrible names, and this one, again, Guinevere with the medieval, um, medieval story of King Arthur, it was kind of weird, uh, not, not really weird, but it, it, I guess kinda, I mean, they welcomed him in their kingdom, and then an accusation happened, I'm assuming what we saw was, um, maybe her side of the story like um right here when he when he come barging in and close that door it's false like that 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 might be her side of the story i don't know if it's the truth or not i'm, I'm i don't know who this is i'm not throughout my history i mean there's so much history that you can't learn it all but uh i wonder how well known the story is i that's actually really cool. Although I will say it's kind of weird that their their masks was not full coverage. Was that even historically accurate? I, I thought masks were always full coverage. Like his kind of was. Yeah, it co it covered his eyes and whatnot. From um, what's that movie from? Yeah, his mask is not. It's like half covered. It's not. I mean, I guess that might be okay, but. Because, yeah, it's hard to see through those masks, even though I've never personally worn it. But I've heard I did go based on a true story. I wish it would say whose true story, though. Medieval, uh, was it Medieval Kingdom? Or that, that little live show? That's really, it's really cool. Medieval Castle, Medieval Kingdom. The truth does not matter. 
There is only the power of men. Well, certain men. These men have no power in a sense. They're just peasants. Uh, well, unless they're knights. They have some power at that point, but not power of kings and prince and princesses and queens, mind you. Your wife will suffer dire consequences. One of us has lied. Let us let God decide. You do not believe me. I am risking my life for you. You are risking my life so you can save your bride. Well, I think, um... I guess that is kind of partially it. And also the fact that, well, if she did cheat, then I think she would be put to death and he could maybe get a new wife, I suppose. I don't, I don't know what the rules are back in the day. I assume that's the case, though. But man, how much, how much people go to war over certain things is just so much pride. And made, well, made history, history I didn't, apparently wasn't taught in uh, history class. I'm definitely curious. Uh, I, again, I do like stuff that's based on true stories. So The Last Duel, October 15th, only in theaters. Okay, so uh, that was interesting. I do like the medieval era. I don't know why. Oh, I didn't realize that she's on the blades here. Um, I do like the medieval era. I like the King Arthur legend. Um, I understand that the legend itself is false, but I think it's an amalgamation of many different characters to form King Arthur, but there's believe there is to believe that a King Arthur did exist. And maybe some of the stories are true, but not all of it. Again, that's what I last heard. This, well, I will say I do have a positive bias in this movie because, again, I, I do like the medieval era and knights and King Arthur, so <laughs> I do have a positive bias on this movie or the trailer. And definitely want to see it. I'm curious. Well, two things got going for it. Again, my I do um, I like medieval eras, knights kings and such and also it's the fact that it's on the base on a true story which amazingly i did not hear if it was if it made history i wonder why we were not thought to, taught this um but anyways uh the trailer looked really good i wished it may have given who it was based on i'm sure if you've heard the story you know who it is but i i personally have not and i guess if i if i did know who it was I'll probably start Googling it and then spoil the story. So maybe I, it's probably best that I did tell, it did tell me. But anyways, I, I really like this trailer. I think it did a pretty good job. It 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 showed a lot of the, the conflict that's going on and the ideas how the woman didn't really... It doesn't matter what the woman says. It's a matter of what men says in this one, especially the two men, the king, the, the husband, and the one that supposedly forced himself on her. I don't know what the truth is again I don't I guess I don't know what the story is so that's interesting it, it makes it, it makes you ask all the right questions that hopefully makes you want to watch the movie which it did for me so anyways this trailer was actually really well done in my opinion I think it makes you ask the right questions and it did for me and I definitely want to go see it I just don't know about the theaters <laughs> I uh, just don't know about the theaters right now. What about you guys? What do you think about the trailer? Did it do a good job in making you want to watch this movie? So let me know in the comments below. If you like my content, please consider subscribing. Thumbs up, thumbs down, down below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next vid.